Yo guys, how's it going? Hope all is well. So today, I'm going to be giving you guys tips and tricks on the choose any club mode on CSE 2022. So one of the things I normally do before the start of every season is to make sure I scout players manually. So you might be asking, dude, what the hell is manual scouting? So it basically means searching through as much players as possible to see which ones fit into your team. And using this method, I've been able to find players who are massively cheap and are really high rated at the same time. You can take for example Odu Beiko, as at the time I bought him it was around 86 rated and his value was really really low around 4.8 mil and I was able to get him for as low as 6 mil. So manual searching, you have my respect. So one of the things that you're gonna wanna do again is to get players who are already high rated. I'm not saying you should start getting all the oldest players on the game because that would be terrible advice. Instead, what I'm trying to say is that since you have just a one year contract to try and prove yourself, the logical thing to do is to get players who will fit into your team straight away, slot into your first 11. I'm not discouraging getting wonder kids who are really low rated and trying to load them out for future purposes. But since you've not gotten a job yet, you need to get players who will help you in that particular season. So that way you have a much higher chance of smashing your targets and getting the job. Another thing that you're gonna wanna do is to review your staff, especially the manager. Check if their playstyle fits into yours, if they're high rated to coach the team, and some other factors like that. You shouldn't just look at just the manager, you should also look at the assistant manager or the head coach or any other key staff if they're not good enough don't be afraid to sack them the last but not the least tip over here is that you should always upgrade your facilities at the end of each season the board always judges you on three main things your financial management the team's performance on the pitch and the amount of funds you spent in upgrading the infrastructure so that tells you how much the board cares about the facilities so with that boys, we come to the end of this video. If you did enjoy and you'd learn something new, do a subscribe and leave a like on the video. Thanks for watching and bye.